Hello, and welcome to another episode of The First Ascendant. So, last episode we cleared all the submissions to get to the main mission. And now we're on Calling of the Descents, the shelter. Let's uh, get right into it. Private, like always. Uh, oh, an elite monster has killed a different Volgus nearby, it turns into an elite one? That's interesting. We're gonna start with Thanks to Kaden and Nathan's Nathan. swift efforts, we've been able to restore the ancestor's DNA using the data that you've sent. Thank you for your hard work. You've all done an excellent job. The ancestor's biometric authentication data has been coded and sent to your receive. Guide, please activate the code when you reach the Ancestor's Vault. There is a chance that we have not yet found the Vulgus that underwent genetic modification using RK. And we haven't confirmed whether the experiment succeeded or not. But the incident in the sterile land has affected my simulations. Vulgus technology is advancing faster than I expected. Almost unnaturally so. Not me to jump there again. <laughs> knock, knock. Who's there? It's pseudo. Descendant, I presume? You can't just let our equipment be, can you? What? Tell us that. My Aceve channel was just switched. Enzo, there's something wrong with the Aceve channel. Enzo, respond. Oh, he's a hacker. It's mine. It's mine. Steve. I forced you to connect to my personal channel. You see, I'm brilliant, just like you. <laughs> now, let's play, fellow RK wielder. Unless there's something wrong with my ears. Sounded to me like this jerk said he has RK abilities. Oh, crap. I didn't even see the fall there. Thankfully, that doesn't count as one of my lives. I don't think it counts as one of my lives. we saw earlier was successful. Now, why don't you come here and give my cold, frozen body a hug, friend? <laughs> oh, is he my Bastards. character? They weren't just researching ways to open the vault. 
now it's clear why the Order of Truth was there. To create this monstrosity. If they only wanted to retrieve the DNA, they would have sent the Legion of Immortality. I guess in the rest didn't spawn because you were still alive, sir. Yep. I guess I could have cheesed uh, this mission if I just kept him alive over there, but eh, that's no fun. can force channels to change. If we destroy it, we will be able to connect to the HQ channel again. I'm loading. Ow, that did a lot of damage. channel is back online. Guide, please modify this code so that the channel cannot be disconnected again. I have established a defensive security code. Communications will not be affected in the future. Another Greg? <laughs> doesn't feel too bad to have my limbs cut off like this. <laughs> it almost feels like I'm dreaming. I'll send you a little present soon. Harry to me Greg. Back up, sir. Back up, back up. I got a little drowns, but... Stay Damn it. Damn, dodge that time. Damn it. I'm loading. I got my shields again, right? Oh, 
I almost died there. There's a strange image on the command HUD. Is that Jaber? <laughs> Vulcas don't usually dream. <laughs> but thanks to the Arche Serum, I dream my every moment. You can call me Jaber. The serum that was injected into the Vulcus was from Jaber. Who is Jaber? I don't remember that character. I don't remember if we met them yet or not. Oh, did I get a yellow, by the way? No, but I got a huge grenade launcher. Once I put attachments on it, it'll probably be better? Yes. No. Well, DPS is lower. But it definitely probably does a lot more damage than the shotgun. No, the shotgun does more damage. No, the shotgun's higher DPS. It doesn't do more damage by the looks of it. We'll do the grenade launcher for now, though, and that's slightly better. And yeah, it's a big light machine gun. Uh, the assassin's hand can No, we won't use the assassin's hand cannon. Oh, wait. Before we do that... See we oh, we got more power to throw modules in here. Nice. I remember getting more power to throw modules in there, but apparently we did. Alright. Looks like we're pretty close to leveling up our characters, too. Iron heart pulses have increased significantly. The vault must be nearby. I'll send a signal to Jeremy. Jeremy, do you read me? Jeremy. Jeremy, respond. Damn. Hang on just a little longer, everyone. He froze me? Little bastard. Nice to see your face, friend. <laughs> oh, he's an ice knight. Can you call me Jay? Just this once. Here I am. Eamon's delay has changed our plans, but it can't be helped. In my next dream, I'll be dancing with your corpse. Oh, that's a huge grenade launcher radius. Oh, crap. It's way bigger than the last one I had. You know, if I don't die here in two milliseconds because my shields are broke. Generate, please. Hey, Mark, damn it. That was my bad. Arnhart pulses have increased significantly. The vault must be nearby. I'll send a signal to Jeremy. Jeremy, do you read me? Jeremy. Jeremy, respond. Are they ate through my shield. Hang on just a little longer, everyone. Yeah, be careful around this guy. I'm loading. It's so nice to see your face, friend. <laughs> Can you call me Jaber just this once? Here I am. Eamon's delay has changed our plans, but it can't be helped. In my next dream, I'll be dancing with your corpse! Oh, you got the three orb thing. Oh, 
Uh, no, this is a dead end. Crap. Oh, that's suicide bomber. Isn't it? Cold guy, you need to go. One of those things destroyed. I'm loading. Whoa, there's a lot of guys up there. My shield first he froze me and took all my shield. Oh, I just needed one of those guys to drop a health cube. Got a six. Our heart pulses have increased significantly. The vault must be nearby. I'll send a signal to Jeremy. Jeremy, do you read me? Jeremy. Jeremy, respond. Damn. Hang on just a little longer, everyone. Die this time, I'll, uh, it's so nice to see your face, stuff. friend. <laughs> you call me Jaber, just this once. Here I am. Heyman's delay has changed our plans, but it can't be helped. In my next dream, I'll be dancing with your corpse! My shield is down. Back, regenerate my shields. Get away, melee guy. the wall got my way again. Did he just regenerate another one?
One ice cream coming up. This could get messy. Is that a healing aura? Oh, he has a healing drone. Wonderful. And I just got froze right in front of him, so he shotgunned me to death. Oh, he has a healing drone. That sucks. Alright. Nade launcher might be a no-go on this one. Well, no, as long as I don't kill myself with it, we should be good. I see a space mine Our target pulses better. have increased significantly. The vault must be nearby. I'll send a signal to Jeremy. Jeremy, do you read me? Jeremy. Jeremy, respond. Damn. Hang on just a little longer, everyone. to see your face, friend. <laughs> Can you call me Jaba? Just this once. Here I am. Heyman's delay has changed our plans, but it can't be helped. In my next dream, I'll be dancing with your corpse! guys froze me. Healing drone. I'm loaded. Let's play every time he gets down 50%. Okay. Uh, I'm sure he's got high frost. Who did I get hit by? Oh, I couldn't get the melee off in time. Okay. We need to put on some cold resistance. Unequip that. Where's my cold resistance? Chill resistance, there we go. We need that up there. Uh... 
Uh, and then... Let's get rid of the skill cost. I'll give us some more points to work with. Then we'll throw on another uh, all attribute resistance. That should help us out survive some of those ice attacks. Iron heart pulses have increased significantly. The vault must be nearby. I'll send a signal to Jeremy. Jeremy, do you read me? Jeremy. Jeremy, respond. Damn. Hang on just a little longer, everyone. I was surprised they didn't hit that healing drone. That was my ability. It has a lot of health, but still. See your face, friend. <laughs> Can you call me? Yeah, Jaber? look at that. That just this way deletes my shields. Here I am. Heyman's delay has changed our plans, but it can't be helped. In my next dream, I'll be dancing with your gods. This could get messy. I'm loading. those up. Oh, nice, I broke him again. Sweet. Shield. Oh, 
still does so much damage. My shield is down. I'm loading. Help her. No, no, no. Loading. Biometric authentication code Oh, I killed him, finally. Descendant. Oh, that was close. Access the vault. Check up our other stuff first. Oh, that was a close one. This war's path hand cannon. It's green. Oh, why not? They're all 33s. I swear I saw a yellow pop. Maybe I was seeing things though. Or maybe it's 31 all the way back. Yeah, it was 31 all the way back here. Cool. It lowers my skill power, but it increases all my abilities. do that. Whatever. Alright, let's get back into the mission. completely lost it, haven't you? Listen. If you spotted the target, you should have said so. What are you doing here by yourself? This is what's gotten everybody so riled up. <laughs> That's it. 
That's what makes us the Ironheart. It's way more impressive than what the rumors say. <laughs> hey, how long do you plan on just standing there? Go back to Albion and bring reinforcements or something. Why are you still here? Go! I'll trust you, dude. the two of us now. <laughs> he got what he deserved. I feel like I'm going to fight him later on in the campaign. I took a couple of attempts. I'm glad I actually beat him, though. Just had to deal with that healing drone. Uh, we get anything good as, like, a mission reward? That doesn't look like it. Got a question about the operation? Descendant, do you have something positive to report finally? Where's the Ironheart now? What? I gave the order for Jeremy to retrieve the Ironheart. I never did that. There must have been a misunderstanding. Nell, did you send those instructions? I've done no such thing over any official channel and even unofficially. I have no reason to contact him. Something's not right. Could it be? Nell, contact Jeremy. Now. I can't get through to Jeremy. His Aceive has been deactivated. And there's no record of him entering Albion either. It can't be. Jeremy is still a descendant. Even if he's sometimes led astray. He's a descendant fighting for humanity who despises the Vulgus with every fiber of his being. Alpha, we should see if we can detect Jeremy's RK and traces of the Iron Heart through the guide. All descendants on standby. Contact the guide for assistance is required. Command to identify Jeremy and last known whereabouts. Prepare for a pursuit operation. Descendant, I've heard about Jeremy. But there's something I must tell you first. When I came into contact with the energy from the second Ironheart, a new function was restored to my system. It's an algorithm for amplifying the void energy sensory field. An early warning system for detecting colossi that are drawn to the Ironheart. However, perhaps because it was transferred through Jeremy's RK, which I am not synced with, my operating system is rejecting this function. Even now, alarm bells are ringing. My functions have been interrupted and my system cannot be recalibrated. Descendant, I am in no doubt that a Colossus is heading towards Ingress at this very moment. Please transfer my sensory field amplification algorithm to Seneca. If we can intercept that Colossus and recalibrate my system, Jeremy and the Ironheart can be found. Please, help me, Descendant. It appears we have no choice. Please handle whatever the guide needs first. As Alpha said, we cannot rely on the guide alone. HQ will do their best to identify Jeremy's last known location and prepare for a pursuit operation. The space-time fabric of the Void is extremely illogical. 
Descendant, is this code related to the void? This algorithm is sophisticated enough to be applied right away. This is truly incredible. So this is the power of the guide that the Descendants have spoken of. But now is not the time to marvel at it. Based on the results calculated from the amplified sensory field, it seems a powerful colossus. The Executioner is heading toward Ingress. As you likely recall from your Descendant training, the blade wielded by the Executioner is a sensitive conductor. If you allow it to power up, it will increase the time you spend in the Void. And the likelihood of failing to intercept the Colossus increases exponentially. Descendant, please proceed with the intercept immediately. That sounds like, don't fight that guy with a bunny. Uh, we'll get a good look at, uh, this guy before. Are you ready to undertake a Void Intercept battle assignment? Uh, the Executioner. Notorious cost that enjoys killing, it uses a huge sword for melee combat and unleashes electrical attacks. Oh, doesn't he look fancy? That doesn't look like a sword though, that looks like a giant Gauss cannon. Oh, it's like a sword comes out of the cannon. Uh, weak point type burst, attack attributes electrical, strong versus fire, very strong against electricity, weak against toxic, uh, normal against ice. Recommend attribute resistance of 900 electric. Damn. Oh, it's level 34 too. But we will have to leave that one for our next episode. Because we're done with this one right now. So, ooh, that's 32. That's two levels above my character level. So I'll, I'll probably figure out some stuff in between. But anyway, like always, hope you guys enjoyed this one. Please leave a like and subscribe. And until next time, later everybody.